In this video, I'm going to demonstrate the D800's power aperture feature. This is the feature that lets you perform stepless aperture changes while recording a video, rather than limiting your aperture changes to the normal one-third stop increments that a DSLR would require. Now, unfortunately, this feature is only available while recording through the actual HDMI port. It's not available when you're recording to an internal media card. For the purposes of demonstration, the feature is still available within LiveView as long as you're not actively recording. To enable the feature, go into the Custom Setting menu into the Movie option. You want to select Option G1 for the Assignment of the Function button, and you want to choose the Power Aperture Open. This will reassign the Function button to open the aperture and also automatically reassign the Depth of Field Preview button to close the aperture. With that configured, if you now press and hold the Depth of Field Preview button, the aperture stops down in a stepless fashion. Then in reverse, if you press and hold the function button, the aperture opens in a stepless fashion. Now it is stepless in regards to the aperture, but it's not exactly noiseless. You can actually hear the aperture lever clicking while you're holding down these buttons. So you'd probably want to use an off-camera mic so that you don't pick up those noises. In that first demonstration, I was in manual exposure mode, so that closing and opening the aperture actually changed the exposure and the brightness of the jar. In this demonstration, I've switched to aperture priority mode so that the exposure remains constant and only the depth of field changes. You can see that the auto ISO is being engaged as I open and close the aperture. 